Hi there, Tom Tunnis. Simka Nolik. Look, I've got a Sorry, problem. Sorry, no time to play. We're busy. Busy? With what? We got put in charge here for the day. We even get to use one of the Pacamats. Papus and Masia went out to visit our Fixie friends. Papus used to be with them at the Space Center years ago. Ever since he was a boy, Papus dreamed of going into space. Then why not? Fixies work on rockets, too. He even got a job at the Astronaut Training Center. He was put in charge of the centrifuge, and he made sure it worked perfectly. The centrifuge is a sort of very fast carousel for training astronauts. And Papus trained inside of it, too. Unfortunately, Papus never knew the rocket was scheduled to fly on his day off. And when he found out, it was too late. And the rocket blasted off without him. Since then, Papus hates his days off. But he still longs to fix something like that centrifuge. You know, something turning around like a washing machine. Too bad for Papus that the one in his house seems to keep working perfectly fine. So that means today you fix everything? Uh-huh. Well then, it's your lucky day, because my car just broke down. Hooray! We've got work to do. Nolik, let's go! Well, what broke down here? Wait a sec. Here, this part broke down. It's all covered in black. I wonder where we can get the same part, but a clean one. A clean one? Hmm. <gasps> Nolik! Genius! There's the same exact part inside the dishwasher. We can take it from there. Come on! Do you have any idea how all these parts are connected to one another? With this thing right under you. It's a special part called a circuit board. A circuit board's made like this. First, the board gets covered with a thin layer of metal. Then, paths are laid onto the board where the electricity is going to flow. After that, all of the extra metal is washed off of it with a special cleaning liquid, leaving the metal paths that were drawn on the board. These paths work just like wires to connect the parts on the board to each other. And then all that's left to do is attach those parts to their places on the paths. Pull it! Uh, uh, Tom Thomas, Tidish! Hooray! It works again! Tom Thomas, I'm about to start the dishwasher. Are there any dirty dishes in your room? Nah. Slow down! Slow what down? Slow down your mom. We took the new part out of the dishwasher, see? Mom, wait, don't start it. You need to put, put, yeah, put in this one uh, dirty cup. No, look, follow me. Inside the TV's the same part. Now back to the dishwasher. <sighs> We barely made it. We grabbed the part from the TV in the living room. Not the TV. Uh, my mom's favorite program is about to start. <gasps> ah! <sighs> the television is working now. And where'd you get the part for it? From your dad's computer in his office. Hi, everybody. I'm home. Hi, hon. Are you ready for dinner? In a bit. I've got to finish a little work on the computer. 
Simka, hurry! Where else can we find that part? Stop. That's enough running. Here, take it back from the car. And then, we put the part back into the computer, and it started working again. Oh, that was really silly. Remember, you little experts, never repair any device at the cost of another one. I understand now. And I understand. If you were smart, you could have taken the part out of the old radio in the closet. Papus, but you know the radio wouldn't work then. That old thing hasn't been working for years. Marcia and I have pulled out half of those parts already. I almost caught one yesterday. I chased him by the flood. But if I told my daddy, he'd say, It's, it's all inside, inside your head. head. You really cannot catch them. Or find their whereabouts. But if you meet a fixer, please don't let their secret out. think so. It's probably, uh... You call for me, children? What's the matter? Take a look. I've never seen anything like it. <gasps> hmm. What in the world could it be? Hit. Maybe it's a bathroom scale? Or a clock with a digital display. Wait a sec. Are there instructions around here for this thing? I couldn't find them anywhere. That's a problem. Well, then let's try to figure it out. What are you trying to figure out up there? What a huge hockey puck! It's big enough for a monster! <laughs> and the name is so silly, T-Robot. <laughs> Why don't they just call it the Troll Butt? Or I got it, the Troll Boat. <laughs> Please, stop the racket. So what could this thing do, huh? I have no idea. We could try finding it on the internet. Where? Just run along, you two. We don't need any internets. We can handle this. Go on, go. Don't interrupt us. Sure, whatever you say. Come, Nolik. We'll find it out by ourselves. Yeah! Uh, how? So, you remember what it was called? Uh-huh. Uh, a troll boat. Nah. A troll bot. You're right. Hop to it. Robotic vacuum cleaner. You mean it vacuums by itself? It's a robot, so yeah. Class, there's just so much cool stuff in this computer. No, look, this information is not on this computer. It's on the internet. From your computer, you can send a letter to another computer. You can also download a song or a photo from another computer. That's all possible because most of the computers in the world are connected to one another as part of a huge web. And this World Wide Web is what we call the Internet. Thanks to the Internet, we can take a peek at just about anywhere in the world and find information we need about anything. It's an electronic vegetable slicer. No, it's a printer for round sheets of paper. There's no way. Grandpus, we found out what they do with it. You're back again? You, you mustn't, mustn't interrupt, interrupt the adult. Just wait a second. Nolik, turn it on. Uh, turn what on? Don't you turn on anything. Ready, Ready set, jump! jump. What is that? It's a robotic vacuum cleaner. It runs itself. And where did you find the instructions for it? On the internet. Just ask and it tells you. 
you can really just ask and it tells you? Uh-huh. If you want, we can show you. We'd love to see it. Sure, why not? Yep. Whoa! <laughs> hmm, on the internet. Hey, 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 wait for me! What's an elephant way? What's an elephant way? What's an elephant way? The answer's easy to get. It says it weighs five tons. It says it weighs five tons. It says it weighs five tons here on the internet. It, it says, says it weighs five tons. It says it weighs five tons. It says it weighs five tons here on the internet. You send a letter to me. I send a letter to you. You send a letter to me. It's just so easy to do. We write 